we talked to an executive of Moderna recently, sabi niya, they can be ready with their vaccine, yung bivalent nila, by November. Tayo naman, are we ready to begin procuring na? Kasi sabi nila, kaya daw medyo mabagal ngayon ang booster take-up. People are waiting for the bivalent na lang. Ah, well, uh, we conducted a survey, no? Para lang to verify all of these uh, parang assumptions na uh, ayaw na ng tao magpa-booster kasi gusto na nila bivalent. So based from the results of our survey, it turned out uh, na mga taong uh, may dalawang boosters na, 97% of them would receive uh, the bivalent vaccine. Yung mga taong may first boosters na, 96% of them would receive the bivalent vaccines. Yung mga taong may first two doses or fully vaccinated, as we, as we define it here, 67% only would receive the bivalent. And those who are not vaccinated, 14% only will receive the bivalent. So if you look at the trends and these results, this would show you that those who had been interested uh, in these vaccines are also the ones interested in these bivalent vaccines. Mm. So uh, just, just to give that information, uh, we had been negotiating with uh, the manufacturers of these bivalent vaccines for over a month already. And uh, we are already set to sign our term sheets with Moderna. Uh, they have committed to us, yes, as early as end of November, they can produce and they can deliver. Uh, tayo naman, syempre, we go through our processes. There are still regulatory processes that we need to undertake, like FDA authorization, uh, plus we need the Health Technology Assessment Council positive recommendations based on law. Mm -hmm. So we need to go through this, but uh, the Philippine government, we have the funds, we are ready to procure, and ang amin ngang estimate kung talagang makukuha na natin ng mga regulatory clearances, by December we have the bivalent mm -hmm. vaccines again. In the meantime, po, I mean, the survey that you that you mentioned, it goes to the attitude of people on whether or not they, they've been waiting for it, they're ready, they will take it, and so on. But just on the scientific soundness of, of that thinking, tama ba yung mga nag-iisip na antayin ko na lang or is there really, is there actually any basis for them to say that mas mabuting antayin ko versus, you know, gaya ng sinasabi natin from the start na, you know, get what's available? Uh, yes, yeah, syempre, uh, hindi naman tayo sang ayon. Uh, but for those, it's going to be different. No? Kasi for those boosted, they already received their boosters. So they are uh, much protected than those just having two doses or not vaccinated at all. So sa tingin ko, yung mga with the first two doses and uh, sa tingin ko rin, part of the reason would be that we are waiting for the bivalent instead of these uh, booster shots that we have right now. I just like to inform everybody that while we wait no, uh, for these bivalent vaccines to arrive, it would be really advisable uh, for people to receive their booster shots right now, especially that we are continuing to ease our restrictions. Mm. This is the protection that you need for yourself and your family.